To enjoy safe cycling, it is vital to have all protective equipment ready and all bicycle parts properly checked before riding. Proper attire enhances safety and protective equipment offers protection in the event of an accident. Wear clothing in bright, light or fluorescent colors to make yourself visible to drivers and pedestrians. Wide leg trousers or long shoelaces may get caught in the wheels or the chain. Use a band to tie up trouser legs if needed. If carrying a backpack, ensure that it is strapped on securely. Wearing gloves can not only protect your hands, but also allow a firm grip on the handlebars. It is also essential to wear a helmet, as well as elbow and knee pads. Follow A, B, C in choosing a helmet. A means the helmet must comply with approved international standards. B refers to bright colors. C means comfort and fit. Make sure that the helmet is the right size and fits comfortably. Always remember the three rules of proper fit, proper positioning and proper strap use when wearing a helmet. Adjust the sizing pad of the helmet to ensure that it will not slip during motion. Leave two fingers width between the helmet and the eyebrows. Adjust all straps so that they stay flat against the face without any twisting or covering of the ears. The side straps should meet just below the ear, making a V-shape under the earlobe. Fasten the chin strap snugly to allow one finger space between your chin and the strap. Finally, move your head. If the helmet stays put, it means the helmet is being worn correctly. A bicycle comprises many parts. Here is a safety checklist before riding. Is there any damage to the frame? Is the bicycle your right size? When sitting on the seat, the tips of your feet should be able to touch the ground. The handlebars should be at the same height as or a bit higher than the seat. Make sure the front and rear lamps, the reflectors and the bell are functioning properly, clean and not obstructed. Check the looseness of the chain and ensure that there is no sign of damage or rust. Inspect the gears and make sure that the brakes can effectively stop the wheels. Press the tires to see whether they have sufficient air and check they are not damaged. Tread patterns should be clearly seen. With all necessary equipment and a well-functioned bicycle that fulfills the safety requirement, you may now enjoy your journey.